And now it's time for All About Animals with your host, Kipper. Ah, what a lovely day. Lesson number one. Birds. What do birds eat? Worms. Yuck! It's great up here, isn't it? I can see my house. Oh, look. It's brought us a worm. What for? Oh, yuck! Lesson number two. Mice. I'm sure I tidied you up. Look at that. Someone's made a hole in my toy box. Hello? Hello? Do you mind? I'm trying to get some sleep. And lesson number three. Parrots. He's ever so clever. He can repeat anything you say. I can repeat anything you say. I am a clever boy. This concludes our Cuddly Critter lessons for the day. To learn more about these and other animals, Look for Cuddly Critters, starring Kipper the dog. Now on home video from your friends at Hit Entertainment. It's a wonderful, wonderful world. Hey, 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 hey. This pirate dancing's fun. It's a quacky, wacky world. Well, blow me down. Ah! Oh! Oh, I'm sorry, Captain. Well, that's all right, Mark. But you know, you shouldn't have said that. I shouldn't have said what? Well, blow me down. <laughs> <laughs> it's a flimsical, whimsical world. Won't you blow me down? Thanks. And most of all, it's a wiggly, wiggly world. It's the wiggles, it's the wiggles. Dancing with their friends hey! It's the Wiggles, it's the Wiggles Fun will never end Ahoy there! We'd like uh -huh. you to clap and sing And dance along too Whoa. Now that everybody's oh, here That'll be so oh, easy, that'll be so easy That'll be so easy to do <laughs> It's a wiggly, wiggly world Look for it on home video From your friends at Hit Entertainment Sounds like a celebration is under construction. Come on, everybody. We've got to get a move on. And it looks like Bob the Builder is putting together one humdinger of a party. Surprise, surprise. You'd better grab your dancing shoes because it's time to celebrate with Bob. The newest home video from Bob the Builder and your friends at Hit Entertainment. Rockin' and rollin'. Bob and his friends will keep you moving and a-grooving all day long. Spud will bring the ice cream. Coming up! Oh, be careful, Spud! And everyone will be dancing up a storm. Plus, there's even exciting rides for the kids. Come celebrate with Bob and all your favorite machines and wear your best party clothes because someone might just take your picture. What's the birdie? Cheese! It's the one party you won't want to miss. Come celebrate with Bob. Now on home video from Hit Entertainment.
get busy, such a lot to do. Building and fixing till it's good as new. Bob and the gang have so much fun. Working together, they get the job done. Can we build it? Better get going, Bob. You've got lots of telegraph poles to put up. Okay, Wendy. I'll call you when I need Muck and Lofty. Don't worry. We'll be here. We're taking inventory. Can we fix it? Yes, you can! Uh, yeah, I think so. All right, team. Are you ready to take inventory? Yeah, I'm ready, Wendy, but I don't know what taking inventory is. Well, Roly, it's when you count up all of your material and equipment, and you see how much you've got, and then you make a list. Oh, huh. I understand. Now, I want you to count everything in the yard while I take care of things in the office. I'll come back soon to see how you're doing. <laughs> Yippee! I love counting! Rock and roll! I'll count the pipes. Yeah. One, two, three, four. Oh, what comes after four? Oh, let's see. Seven pencils, five packets of paper, four rolls of sticky tape. Uh, oh, hello, Pilcher. What have you got there? Oh, <laughs> just Bob's old work clothes. <laughs> Good job, Scoop. Time for a break. I've just got to call Wendy first. Okay, Bob. Thirty-seven paper clips. Oh. Hello, Bob's building yard. Hello, Wendy. How's the inventory going? Oh, fine, Bob. Oh, by the way, I found some of your old work clothes under the desk. Oh, yes. I was going to take them to the recycling center, but I forgot. Well, I'm going into town later. I'll take them if you like. Thanks, Wendy. Anyway, I just called to say that I'll be needing muck and lofty pretty soon. Okay, Bob. Bye. Okay, Scoop. Better go. Won't be long. No problem, Bob. See you later. <laughs> what you doing, Scoop? Just having a break before I start work again. Ah, uh, you're always working. Don't you ever have any fun? Of course I do. I like a good laugh. Well, how about having some fun now, huh? Uh, what kind of fun? Fun fun. You know, plain jokes. <laughs> Fooling around. <laughs> well, it is my break. Great, come on. All right, Muck and Lofty. Bob needs you. We'll meet you at the farm, okay? Okay. Okay. Let's go. Bye, Wendy. Bye. Bye. Yeah, bye. bye. See you later. <sighs> Here he comes. Hello, Travis. Do you like my magic bale of hay? Huh? What's magic about it? I can make it fly, like a magic carpet. No, you can't. You're putting me on. Oh, yeah? Watch this, then. Abra, cadabra. Lift me up now. <gasps> it is magic. <laughs> Come on, Scoop. Let's find someone else to play a trick on. <laughs> Uh, three and three are six, and another three is, uh, nineteen. Uh, is that right? Here, Scoop. Lift me up. Sure, Spud. <laughs> Just wait till Muck hears my scary voice in the sky. What a laugh! <laughs> now, you go and hide. Okay, Spud. Sky! Woo! Uh, like a, 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 I'm out of here! 
<laughs> hey, hold on, Scoop. Let's have some more fun. Let's find Lofty and scare him, too. Oh, no, Spud. Lofty's really scared of you. Anyway, my break's over now. I've got work to do. Ow! You're no fun. I'll have to go and find it myself. Uh, um, let's see. Uh, Farmer Pickle's farm is, um, this way. At least I think so. Here he comes. That's a good one, Lofty. Come on, you can get up again now. No, I can't. What do you mean you can't? Uh, uh, I can't move. Oh, no. Hold on. I'll go again. Help. Scoop. 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 What is it now, Spud? I'm busy. It's Lofty. He's stuck on his side and he can't get up. You've got to come and help him. Stop fooling around, Spud. I've got work to do. But, Scoop, Lofty really is in trouble. What's all this about Lofty being in trouble? Lofty's stuck. Honest, Bob. Well, he should have been here by now. Better safe than sorry. Come on, let's go. Oh. Don't worry. We'll have you right side up soon. Oh, oh, I, I hope so. Okay. All together now. There, Lofty. Are you all right? Oh, uh, I think so, yeah. Thanks, Bob. Thanks, Scoop. Better thanks, Spud. He was the one who came for help. Um, well, uh, it was my fault, really, Bob. I, I scared Lofty, and that's why he got stuck. Oh, I see. Well, what do you say then, Spud? Sorry, Lofty. Oh, that's okay, Spud. Easy, easy, Lofty. Okay. Well, that's it, team. Another job well done. Even if Spud's little pranks did hold us up. Yeah, it's not so funny when someone plays a joke on you. Spud never thinks of that. Oh, that's given me an idea, Scoop. Oh, you! We finished! Oh, you've done very well, both of you. Oh. Hello, Bob's building yard. Oh, hello, Bob. Yes, your old clothes are still here. Why? Oh, well, Bud's over. Time to scare a few crows. Hey, hold on. Who's this? What's he up to? Didn't Farmer Pickles tell you? He's decided you're too naughty. He's gotten another scarecrow instead. What? I, he, he can't do... He can't do that. What about me? Hey, you can't stand there. I'm the scarecrow around here. <laughs> Surprise, surprise, bud! <laughs> <laughs> hey, Bob, that's not funny. Come on, Spud. I thought you liked a good laugh. Oh, well, I... I, I suppose I do. <laughs> Here, you can borrow my nose if you like. <laughs> What a big delivery. Do you want us to stack it, Wendy? Yeah, can we? Whoa, hold on. I need to check that everything's here. Can I help, Wendy? Can I please? Of course you can, Dizzy. Whee! <laughs> what are we looking for first, Wendy? Have we got four loads of bricks? One, two, three, four. Good. Now how about three stacks of lumber? Bob needs them for his job tomorrow. <laughs> One, two, Three! Okay, that's everything. Can we put it away now, Wendy? <laughs> yes, you can. Hooray! 
I'll just go into the office and see if there are any faxes. Whoa. Careful, Lofty! Look out, Lofty! What was that, Dizzy? Whoa. Watch Whoa. out, Dizzy! Stop, everyone! Oh, my! Sorry, Wendy. There's not enough room. We need to work together and cooperate to get this job done. Just like Dizzy and I did with the checklist. All right, Scoop, you go first. No prob, Wendy. Okay, Lofty, you next. Oh, uh, Buck? Swing your crane. Now, Lofty. Great! It's working, Wendy. Well done, team. We finished. That was great, Wendy. And lots of fun. That's because we helped each other out and all worked together. All right, Bob. You, Muck, and Rolly are working on the new section of road. And I'm taking along the line marking machine for them. That's right, Travis. Then we can paint a nice line down the middle to finish everything off. So, if everyone's ready, let's go! Can they fix it? Yes, yes we, we can! can! Bye! All right. Rolly, I want this road surface nice and flat. Okay! I'm rolling! <laughs> Muck, you can help me unload the line marking machine. Okay, bye! Now, we need to fill up the line marking machine with a special white paint. Okay, as soon as Rolly's finished, we'll paint the white lines. Ooh, this looks like fun. Lots of fun. <laughs> Hello, Bob the Builder. Oh, hello, Mrs. Potts. What can I do for you? Oh. Oh, my. Well, I'll tell you what. I'll drop by quickly now. It won't take very long to fix that. No, it's no problem. See you soon. Bye. Come on, Muck. We need to go over to Mrs. Potts to do a quick repair job. Jump on, Bob. Back in a jiffy. All right, Bob. I'll be here. Oh, 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 boy. <laughs> hey, Travis, Travis. Oh, there you are. Farmer Pickles wants you down at the pond. He says it's very urgent. Ooh. I better get going. See you, Rolly. Catch you later, Travis. Oh, oh no! Travis! Travis! Stop! You're making lines everywhere! Oh, I'm gonna have to try and catch him. That's strange. Where's Travis going in such a hurry? Oh my, oh my, I'd better call Bob. Someone's got to stop Travis. Rolly, Rolly! Uh, All uh, that tractor! Uh, uh, I'm trying, I'm trying. Bob's building yard. Oh, hello, Farmer Pickles. Oh, no. White paint everywhere? Oh, now don't worry. I'll tell Bob right away. Thanks. Yes, you bye. There you go, Mrs. Potts. 
Your fence is fixed. Oh, <laughs> thanks, Bob. I was so worried my dog would get out, you know. Oh, excuse me, Mrs. Potts. Hello, Bob the Builder. Oh, hi, Wendy. The line marking machine? On the back of Travis? White lines everywhere? Oh, my. We're on our way, Wendy. Don't worry. Golly, Mrs. Potts, gotta go. We have an emergency. Oh, of course. Thank you, Bob. Bye. We've got to stop Travis before he pays the whole town white! Travis! Travis! Don't go so fast! Oh, oh, I'm really tired out. Come on, Mark! Speed up! at this mess. Ooh, it wasn't my fault, Bob. I didn't know the line marking machine was hooked onto me. I thought it was my trailer. I don't know how it got there, honest. <laughs> I tried to stop him, Bob, but he was in such a hurry. <laughs> Spud said Farmer Pickles needed me at the pond right away. <laughs> hmm. Did he now? Spud? Spud? Come out of there now! All right, Spud. What do you know about all of this? Um, uh, oh, me? Nothing. So who hooked the line marking machine onto Travis, then? Um, oh, oh, it was me, Bob. I was just having fun. I didn't mean any harm, you know. Well, I think you've got some cleaning up to do. Isn't that right, Bob? That's right, Farmer Pickles. Sorry, Bob. Spud's on the job, Bob. Oh, my knees hurt. Oh, uh, well, I'm sorry, Spud. You'll just have to keep scrubbing until you've cleaned it all up. All right, everyone else, let's go home. Hooray! Bye, Spud. Bye. <laughs> You're back. Did you find Travis? Yeah, yeah. What's happened? Tell us. Come on, come on. Oh, well, um, it, well, uh... Well, it was Spud, Wendy, and, 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 and the line marking machine, and then... And, and Bob was telling me to go yeah, faster and I was and getting faster, really, and, really and, tired. And I was trying, trying to go chase around the corner, and, really and my difficult. wheels were like, I don't almost know coming off the, the road. road. Whoa, and I was... one at a time. <laughs> I wish I'd been there to see all the fun and mess and everything. <laughs> oh. Loaded. 
Come on, Spud. Farmer Pickles won't want us to be late delivering his corn to the market. <laughs> In a minute. I'm busy. Spud, what are you doing? Looking at the clouds, Travis. They're making all sorts of funny shapes. Clouds? Making shapes? Don't be silly, Spud. It's true. Look, Travis, one of them is shaped like a tractor, just like you. A tractor like me? I can't see a tractor. <gasps> oh, you're right. It does look a little like me. <laughs> I told you. Oh, and look, that cloud just to the side. It's shaped like a cat. <laughs> what about that cloud up there? Where, Spud? There. What does it remind you of, Travis? I think... I think it looks like a giant teapot. <laughs> oh, look, a giant piece of corn. Corn. Oh, no, Spud. Weren't we supposed to be doing something? Yes, you were. Huh? You were supposed to be taking my corn to the market, not daydreaming with your head in the clouds. Yes, Farmer Pickles. Sorry, Farmer Pickles. I'll get going. You're we'll late for the market. You can trust us, Farmer Pickles. Spud's on the job. <laughs> ah, the day that I can trust Spud is the day that pigs can fly. <laughs> <laughs> wow, look at that cloud. It looks just like a flying pig. <laughs> oh, thanks, Muck. Okay, you two. It shouldn't take long to finish these repairs. See you back at the yard. Bye, Bob. Yeah, see you later. <sighs> Not working today, Spud? Nah, it's too hot. And we've been... We've been... <sighs> giving the day off. <laughs> Not by me, you haven't. Go on, back to work, you two. Hey, yes, Farmer Pickles. Sorry, Farmer Pickles. Spud's on the job, Farmer Pickles, sir. <laughs> Phew, Roly, it's really hot. Yeah, you. Let's take a break, okay? <laughs> Is the work too hard for you? Yeah, can you only go slow? Hey, I like things nice and slow. Beep, beep, beep. We're faster workers than you any day. Farmer Pickles says I'm the fastest tractor he's ever had. Yeah, so... Oh, yeah? Yeah. I'm still faster than you are. Are not. Am too. Are not. Prove it. How? Why don't you race each other? All right, Spud. Oh, uh, I will race you, Travis. Oh, uh, uh, all right. Yeah, right. Today at noon, meet you at the duck pond. All right, come on, Rolly. We'd better tell Bob. Wait for me! Oh, Spud, what have I done? I shouldn't have said I'd race Scoop. I'll lose. Why? Farmer Pickle said you were the fastest tractor. Didn't he? Travis? Uh, not exactly. He said I was the fastest talker he's ever had, not the fastest tractor. I've never been in a race in my life. Travis. Travis, 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 Travis! Dizzy, where's Bob? We need his help for the race. What race? What's all the noise about, Scoop? Hi, Bob. I need you to help me with the race. Race? What race? I'm having a race against Travis at noon by the duck pond. Oh, how exciting. Oh, we must get organized. If you're having a race, you'll need a course to race around. Isn't that right, Bob? Yes, Wendy. They'll need a racetrack. Bob, can you fix it? <laughs> yes, I can. Hooray! <laughs> Hooray! Scoop's going to win! Scoop's going to win! All right, Muck, you better come with me. Come on, Travis, move it, move it, move it! You're not fast enough! It's no use. You'll never beat Scoop like this. I know, sorry. So, I'll have to think of something. Good 
job, Muck. Now let's get back and join the others at the start. Okay, Bob. <laughs> okay, everybody. I've drawn a map of the race course. Scoop, Travis, you start here at the pond, follow the arrows down the country lane into the town, pass the yard, back into the country again, and finish back here. So, take your places! Ready? Go, Scoop, go! Uh, quiet, quiet, please. Sorry, Bob. Ready? Get, Get set? set? Go! Bob, how are we gonna see who's winning from here? Hmm. Good point, Muck. Oh, I know. Lofty, can you lift me up to the barn roof? Uh, yeah. I think so, Bob. Good. Let's go, then. Okay. Going up. Careful up there, Bob. Whoa! Hey, hey! Great view! I can see the yard from here, Lofty. But what about Scoop and Travis? Oh, yeah. Um... And we're off to a flying start now with Scoop in the lead. Go, Scoop! Wow, this is exciting, isn't it? Uh, oh, jump up, Elchard. Then you can see better. <laughs> I've never seen a race before. Can Scoop win it? Yes, he can! To. What? Uh, oh, uh, hey, that's the stuff that was slowing me down. Oh, Spud, that's not the kind of help I wanted. Um, uh, I can explain. Uh, you see, it was, uh, was like this. Um, 
Uh, it was just a joke, and uh, Spud, I, what's uh, the? Uh, 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 Good job, Rolly. All right, on to the next job. But first, we'll block off the road. We don't want anyone walking in the asphalt before it dries. And Spud's way out in front, and he's coming up to the first hurdle! He made it! No one can beat Sporty Spud! Sporty Spud does it again! Okay, that's done. We'd better get back to the first job and make sure the asphalt is dried. But what do we do first? Block, Block off, off the, the road, road Bob. Bob! Better safe than sorry. Oh, someone stepped in the wet asphalt. Look, Bob, footprints. Yes, and I have a feeling I know who they belong to. Come on, we'll follow them. <laughs> and Spud's coming up to the finish line. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Aha, Spud. I thought those footprints looked familiar. Well, Spud, now do you see why we blocked off the road? Yes, Bob. Sorry, Bob. If the road is blocked off, that means there's something dangerous there, and you should stay away. I won't do it again, Bob. Promise. Whoa! Oh, Spud. <laughs> no. All right, team. Today we've got to finish putting those windows in the roof at the Lazen Bees. Scoop, Lofty, Mutt, you're with me. And Dizzy, we're going to put up a new rotary dryer in Mrs. Potts' garden. Oh, brilliant! <laughs> What's a, a a a rotary dryer, Dizzy? Uh, it's a sort of um. <laughs> Hello, Farmer Pickles. Of course we can. I've got some old tires lying around the yard. It's no trouble. We'll be passing the farm anyway. That was Farmer Pickles. He wants us to drop off some tires on our way to today's job. Oh, right. Well, see you later, Bob. Come on, Dizzy. We shouldn't keep Mrs. Potts waiting. She's probably got lots of clothes to dry. Wow. What does Farmer Pickles need tires for, Bob? Good question, Scoop. I forgot to ask. What is a ro rat rat ro 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 dryer, Wendy? <laughs> rotary dryer, Dizzy. It's a clothesline. Only it spins round instead of being straight. Oh! <laughs> I see. Ah! Uh, uh. Ah! Here's Bob with those tires. About time, too. Hang on, Spud. Muck to the rescue. Lofty, can you give me a hand? Oh, yeah. I think so, Bob. Right, Scoop. Can you put a few tires on this corner? No problem, Bob. <laughs> Careful, Scoop. <laughs> there. That should do it. Oh, my. I think you've got hay fever, Scoop. What? 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 Hay fever, Bob? It's an allergy, Scoop. It means if you go too close to something, it can make you sneeze and give you runny eyes. Some people are allergic to cat fur or dog hair. Oh. Oh, my. <laughs> You're allergic to things like hay and grass and flowers. <laughs> you know what Spud's allergic to? Work. <laughs> I heard that. Okay, if no one here wants me, I'll go and find someone who does. 
I think you better go back to the yard, Scoop. Uh, 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 all right, Bob. Come on, Lofty. Pass me some more tires. Hello, Mrs. Potts. Morning, Wendy. I can't decide where my rotary dryer should go. Could you hold it up for me so I can see what it looks like over there? Bob sent me home. I've, I've, I've got hay fever. Oh! You better take it easy, Scoop. Okay, let's get this finished. I'll get up on the roof and get to work. We don't want to fall down on the job. Especially not when you're on the roof. <laughs> Very funny, Muck. All right, no time to waste. We have to hurry because you never know when it might start raining. And we don't want the Lazy Beast to have a wet attic, do we? No, no we no. don't, Bob. Okay, team, can we fix it? Yes, we can! Uh, yeah, I think so. Oh, oh. All right, Dizzy. This is where the dryer will go. Are you ready with the cement? Uh, coming right up, Wendy. Oh, oh. Whee! Oh. Hello? Hello? Spud's here! Oh, oh, oh. I see. Too busy for Spud, are you? Here, catch! Oh, you're no fun. I'm ready for some more tiles, Lofty. Huh? Oh, okay, Bob. Here we are, Bob. Be careful, Spud. Those tiles are easily broken. Sorry, Bob. Let Lofty do it, okay? I was only trying to help, Bob. Well, Spud, I've got another job for you. Why don't you go back to the yard and check that Scoop's all right? You bet. Spud's on the job, Bob. <sighs> Bob can rely on me. Don't worry, Scoop. Dr. Spud will soon make you better. Oh, oh Wendy, it's just what I need. Here, just a little something to say thank you. Oh, that's very kind of you, Mrs. Potts. <laughs> my pleasure. Hey! <laughs> oh, my goodness! Spud the Spinning Scarecrow! Whee! My new dryer! Get down, Spud! Well, I was just making sure it works. It isn't a toy, Spud. Anyway, shouldn't you be scaring birds? Not today. Bob's given me an important job to do. Can't stand around talking. <laughs> <laughs> that Scarecrow. Thanks, Muck. Well, I think we're all finished here. Hey, what's that, Lofty? Spud must have left it. We'd better take it back to the yard. Off we go! Ta-da! Spud calling Scoop! Hey, shh, shh! Don't wake him up, Spud! Scoop's not well. I know! Bob sent me to look after him. I've got to find out what makes Scoop sneeze. He's got hay fever, Spud. We know that already. But what if he's allergic to something else, like a, like milk? Does this make you feel like sneezing? Bud, leave Scoop alone. What about cat fur? He is allergic to hay. Hay? Well, what about me? Scarecrows are stuffed with hay. Oh, what are you doing, Spud? Does this make you feel like sneezing? Don't be silly, Spud. You're made of old hay. Only fresh hay can make Scoop sneeze. Uh, 
Are you all right, Scoop? Uh, no, not too bad, Wendy. Thanks. Ha-ha! <laughs> These flowers are fresh. Do they make you sneeze, Scoop? Spud! <laughs> That's done the trick! Scoop! Spud! What's going on? <laughs> oh, oh, oh my! Look out! I'll take those. Thank you, Spud. Spud! You're supposed to be keeping out of trouble. I was only trying to help, Bob. Well, well don't. don't! All right. I I won't. Uh, do you think you could take this tire off me now, Bob? Well, only if you promise that you won't try and help anyone else. I promise, Bob. Great. And I hope that's the last tire we'll have to move today. Thanks, Bob. Spud's not on the job, Bob. Now, Spud, I'd like you to pick six juicy apples for me. I'm going to make a nice apple pie for dinner tonight. Oh, yummy. I love apple pie, Farmer Pickles. I know you do, Spud. I'll save you a big slice to thank you for helping. Spud's on the job. I'll see you later, Spud. <laughs> These should be juicy enough. That's one. Two, three, four, five. Just one more. That's all of them. One, two, three, four, five. Huh? That's funny. I had six. Oh, well, I better pick one more. That's it. Six apples. One, two, three, four, five. Huh? That's not right. Something funny's going on. I'll just pick another apple. Gotcha! Come back here with my apple! Spud's on the job! 